Welcome to part 4 of the use of Microsoft Excel in the building of wireframes and screenflow diagrams. Linked wording files to wireframes. Wording files are extremely important. They help keep a record of all changes made, but also assist with the language used in the application. You see, I've already created a number of columns. First is the screen number. Second refers to the item or component in that screen. The third column shows the UI wording. That is the term I use in creating the wireframe. The next column is a description of the term or what that button does. This description is very important as it will be necessary for the brand and tone of voice teams to understand the meaning behind the words so they may use their style of wording on the button for the end client, be they English, French, Spanish, or indeed any other language. Indeed, it becomes even more important when translating to other languages, as very often it will not be a direct translation from the English. For an example of the description column text, it should state that the selection of the mobile banking button will check to see if the product is online. If it is, then it will display the login screen to your bank account. If it is offline, it will display the offline notification. I have also listed all the components from my first screen. The title, the body text, the buttons, with their text and description. Let's go and link our first wording file to the wireframe. We'll use the message box as an example. First we select the appropriate text box and then select the formula bar. That's the long input box at the top of the sheet marked FX. Move the text already there if there is any and type in an equal sign. Then click the wording file tab and select the cell that contains the appropriate text and press return. To show that the two are indeed linked, I shall reword the network error to connection error, something that will please our local operator. Turning to the wireframe, we can see the change has indeed taken place. I've already linked the body text, and I shall change that to read, Sorry, we are unable to connect to the network. Please try later. And you will see that has changed too. You can do the same with the graphical elements. You see the bank icons next to the title. We have an icon library too, and following a rebranding exercise, I've been issued with updated logos. I shall paste the new logo in the placeholder. You will see all the logos have been updated. Let's change the company name to match. next demo, I shall show you how to link the icons and logos.